Somebody should become an exercise scientist if they have an interest in exercise, healthcare, um, potentially in sport and performance, uh, and somebody that's empathetic and is looking to make a difference in the patients and communities that they find themselves working in. My name is Micah Atkinson and I'm the course lead for the Clinical Exercise and Rehabilitation Science program here at AECC University College. The role of an exercise scientist is incredibly varied um, and it'll be determined by the, the route that you choose. So it could be more clinical focused, so working in, for example, an NHS setting, or it could be more performance based, so working with um, first responders, military or elite level athletes to recover from injuries or surgery and get them uh, ready to perform again. I would recommend you become an exercise scientist if you have an interest in exercise, healthcare, um, performance, uh, and you're looking to make a difference. If you're an empathetic person and you're looking to really make a difference in the community that you work in, uh, whether that be in the NHS or in performance, um, but you're looking to improve the quality of people's lives uh, and get them ready for performance. Qualifications you would need to become an exercise scientist would be ideally A-levels, um, preferably with uh, biology or human biology, um, or a B-tech, um, again, ideally with a, a sports focus. The beauty of exercise science is that there is no typical day, um, irrelevant of the environment you find yourself working in. So again, whether that be in the NHS, um, working with cardiac patients, pulmonary patients, or again, working with uh, performance individuals, um, it's, it's always going to be different. You're working with different people, different challenges, uh, and that, that's part of the beauty. What I would say to somebody that's thinking of a career in exercise science is to firstly make sure that you have an interest in exercise. Um, do you have a, a passion for sports or healthcare? Um, and again, are you an empathetic person and are you looking to make a difference uh, in the lives of the patients and the communities that you'll find yourself working in? Mm -hmm.